What's up guys, that is Jonathan with One Big Impact. So really quick, this video is going to be in its entirety, under three minutes, helping you understand exactly how to max out on the three power lifts. At the end, I'm going to probably tell you the single most important information that you can use while maxing out. So first of all, it is important that you understand, are you going to do all three lifts, squat, bench, and deadlift? Are you going to be doing just squat, just bench, or just deadlift, okay? So if and when you find out which one you're going to do, understand if, if you are the type of person that trains squat, bench, and deadlift simultaneously, or at least some variation of it, like say I'm going to do a heavy bench today and I'm gonna do my bench session, and then I'm gonna do a squat variation, and then I'm going to do a deadlift assistance exercise. If that is you, then I think it's probably okay for you to be able to do a squat bench and deadlift max in a single day. If you don't normally train like that, it's going to be pretty crappy numbers. Squat would be in my opinion first because it's the most technical and it, it is the most physically draining bench to give your back a break and then end with deadlift because it's the, mo the least technical in my opinion, or at least you can muscle up good weights without having to do much besides just stand up. So, how do you max out? And at the end, remember, I'm going to tell you how, and uh, by, by the way, go check us out on Instagram at One Big Impact. So first of all, you're gonna take your number, whatever that number is, say it's gonna be like, say, well, well, for, the, for the sake of math, we'll say 100 pounds. You go grab your calculator and you say 100 pounds times 0.5. And you're gonna hit that for eight reps, that's 50 pounds. Then you're gonna go times 0 0.6, that's 60 reps, 60 pounds. You're gonna hit that for five reps. Then you're gonna go times 0 0.7, you're gonna hit that for three reps. 0 0.8, hit that for one rep. 0 0.9, hit that for one rep. 0 .9, uh, 0 0.10, which is basically just, you're going for the full max. And then you're gonna go ahead and hit the max. Now the key tip, the key tip here, that I wanted you to wait for at the end of this video is your rest periods freaking matter so much. In the beginning, when you hit eight reps, two minutes rest. Five reps, two to three minutes rest. Three reps, three to four minutes rest. One rep, four minutes rest. One rep, four to five minutes rest. Before you hit your max, maybe seven to eight minutes rest, depending on how heavy you lift. If you are panting, you should not be getting under a heavy bar. I hope that information helps. See you later.